Hi, I'm Josh. I'm Ollie. And today we're trying some jolly Filipino snacks. Filipino snacks. We've received multiple crap. <laughs> Oh, it almost oh, went everywhere. Gosh. We've combined a bunch of people's packages, right? Because Filipino Jolly Beans. You guys are the special forces you in the Jolly Bean are. Army. Except Filipino unlike the special forces, strong. you don't go in undetected. You go in loud and proud. We have received a lot of, of boxes and letters and postcards from the Philippines. We love people in the Philippines. You've been. I have. I have a beautiful been place ever. For now, we don't need to go to the Philippines just yet because the Philippines has come to us via you lovely Jolly Beans at home. <gasps> now what is it's a Jolly Bee? He's Jolly! We're Jolly! Kamusta? 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 To everyone in the Philippines. And Salamat. 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 Hey! Alright. <gasps> what? Did we see these already in a mail opening? Because I have forgotten about them completely if we did. Firstly, it's called Jolly. The slogan is can't get enough. But secondly, their subtitle is very descriptive. Finger cream sandwich cookies. I don't want finger cream. <laughs> finger cream? Finger cream at a time like finger this, Josh, should be antibacterial and nothing else. <laughs> Here we go. All right, cheers. Mmm, oh, it's like a custard cream. But it's a bit fruitier. Mm. It's kind of lemony. Who knew finger cream tastes like lemon? Maybe it's all the soap. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least it's clean. Jolly, Come can't get it. enough. I would say I probably could have enough of that. <laughs> <laughs> but I, it's, enough. it's quite nice. Probably quite enough. nice. Those would go great with a cup of tea. Yes. Great with a cup of tea. And Maybe a little dippage and they wouldn't disintegrate immediately. Disintegrate. Though you'd have to keep a watch you on would. the disintegration. Eventually factor. they would. Wow, this is great content they right would. now. <laughs> Hit me. What's next? Sweet scorn. I think it's just sweet corn. Oh. <laughs> Why do they put a big S? <laughs> <laughs> no, you know what? It's not meant to be open like that. Is it meant to be open that way? I don't think it's meant to be opened at all. Oh! Oh my gosh. It smells just like sweet corn. That's so weird. It's weird to call something that is flavored like that just the name of the thing that it's being flavored. It's like calling ketchup. Tomato. <laughs> <laughs> you know? That's good. Well, maybe it is oh, supposed to be red sweet corn. Horrible. What are you talking about? These are great. It just tastes like the water that sweet corn is cooked in. Why did you say that? That's ruined it. I poured sweet scorn on it. Sweet oh, come on. <laughs> that's bitter scorn, Ollie. That is very bitter. bitter. Well, these aren't bitter. They are sweet. I was really enjoying that until you said that it tastes like flipping corn brine. They do taste like corn brine. I'm torn now. I'm torn. All right. Come on, moving along. Next up, uh, Chippy. Chippy. Guess there's just no explaining the craving for Chippy barbecue from Jack and Jill. What? It could be the original crunch that makes it everybody's favorite. Or it could be the taste of the barbecue. So rich. Maybe it's the crunch and the flavor. It sounds like they've written their own Amazon review. Yeah, On their product. They've pitched big. They've pitched big. Okay, they're saying they're everyone's favorite snack. Literally everyone. They're saying it's crunchy and there's an amazing barbecue flavor. So I think we should rate it on those two things. They don't look like I expected them to. No, they're very irregular shapes. They just look like shavings of like a normal crisp packet. How's the crunch? That is very crunchy. That, yeah, pretty good. Barbecue flavor? Subtle, but good. Can I say? I would just, I'd just flip and plow straight through a pack of them. On this piece that you ripped it. off, fortified with iron. Oh, why did they, why did they choose to do that? Part of me thinks maybe no. there was a leak in the factory. And they're like, how okay. do we make this a plus? <laughs> <laughs> well, whatever they've done, they've done it well. Because that is a, for legal has... reasons, that's not an accusation. <laughs> <laughs> how many do we have? Are we gonna, is this going to take all day? Wait, Let's right. just, come okay. on. All right, all right, all right. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's letters. We didn't even oh. read the flipping letters. Wait, no, we've opened these before. Well, thank you so much. All the way from Manila and Singapore. This is so sweet, guys. All right. Pretty sweet. Thank you. This what is your fancy? also fortified with iron. Okay, that must. But it's also, it's also made Jack by and Jack Jill. and Jill. Explains we know what's it. going on, Jack Explains and Jill. Explains it. All right, come on. Okay. Crack, crack that open. Okay. That doesn't really smell of much. Oh, what does it say on the back of this? Wow. Oh. Because it's Jack and Jill, it's got another blurb at the back, like an oh, Amazon. Gosh. This, this is the Amazon review. This is, this is their thing. For Piatos. Okay. okay. Just when you thought you'd seen and tasted every snack imaginable, along comes. Piatos. 
<laughs> a breakthrough in potato snacks. Okay. So revolutionary, okay. it can change the way snacks are enjoyed. Wow. When you taste its rich flavor and feel its unique texture, you yeah. know why there's no other snack like piados. Wow, okay. Uh, I must say, as an Englishman, this looks wonderful. It just looks really bland. Plain. What's it made from? It looks like it's baked. Oh, it's got like a really subtle cheesy flavor. Mm. I can't taste the iron. <laughs> <laughs> that is good. I love it. Does it revolutionize the way snacks are enjoyed? No. Okay. <laughs> There's some salesmanship going yeah. on. I like them. I like them a lot. That is a contender for favorite snack mm. that we've tried today. Which would be ironic because the other one they said is everyone's that favorite. That is true. I'll try this bad boy. Marty's Cracklin. Wait, is it actual Cracklin? Vegetarian, Chicaran, old fashioned style, guilt free. This one on the back, it just says, Oh my gulai. Oh wow. Let's do it, let's uh, do it, let's do it. Okay. So apparently these are a salt and vinegar flavor Cracklin salt snack. Salt and vinegar flavor? I thought we were the only ones that did salt oh. and vinegar flavor. No. There's a lot of places that do it, I think. Oh, oh that's vinegary. Wow. What are these made from? Honestly, just tastes like the weirdest salad I've ever eaten. <laughs> <laughs> you know? yeah. I don't know what it is. It's crispy and vinegary like a salad dressing. Wait, what are they? Green, Dehydrated green peas. Green peas. That's where the salad flavor's coming from. Weird. This is really good. They are good. Oh man, we need to stop eating too many. We've got so many things to try. All right. Let's back on! Hey! This one, the brand, Peewee. And they've got a flying Peewee man! This is amazing. It's also fortified with vitamin A. Fortified. Hey, it's fortifying the heck out of things in the oh, Philippines. Two things that I've learned from Filipino food. They love their mascots, right? They do. Jollibee, Pee Wee Man. McDonald's used to have a mascot, but it's kind of gone out of fashion because it's like yeah. a terrifying clown. Yeah, creepy ass clown. And a burglar, like a hamburger. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you could have a mascot, a hamburger. surely they should, they should be like doctors. <laughs> or... Yeah, like this guy, a flying chef. I want me some Pee Wees. Okay. That is literally the last thing I expected that to smell like. Has Pee Wee been <laughs> peeing? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's just the presence of the word pee what that makes it smell done? like pee. <laughs> you know what I would say that is? There's everything wrong with oh. meat flavouring. <laughs> Things that are made to taste like meat. Oh, Pee Wee, what like have this. you done? Pee Wee. That is definitely my least favourite so far. Oh, it's got a blurb on the back. It takes two to have fun. It's Pee Wee and you. <laughs> <laughs> Peewee, the crunchy snack, relished <laughs> with the right blend of spicy Why? barbecue and saltiness. I do appreciate these blurbs. I do. They're entertaining. I can't believe you're having a second one. It smelled weird and it tasted weirder. Maybe if we grew up on them, you know? This one, though, butter coconut biscuits. Three words I like a lot. Mm -hmm. Put them together. I'm excited. Let's see. I like how it's packaged like a slab of butter. Ah, oh, you know? that's clever. Yeah, it's clever. That is clever. Oh, wow. Did not expect it to be packaged like this. Whoa, that is a lot of butter cookies. Can I just say, I'm used to packaging where it's a lot of air, very little filling. That is the opposite. Holy crap. That's an English palette right there. <laughs> In coconut biscuit form. It's slightly more flavorful than and anything we have Toast here. with a bit of sugar on. <laughs> <laughs> mm. That's really good. Mm. Really easy going. Mm. Slightly sugared, a little bit of coconut flavoring, mm. but only a tiny bit. Even if you don't like coconut, you'll still like that. Mm. <laughs> You're writing the blurb right now. Uh, uh, butter. Mm. The, the butter is what makes out. it shine. Okay, I'm impressed. Next up, boy, bang wang. <laughs> 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 oh no, it wasn't bang wang, it was bar wang. And so I want to make a public apology, which is still funny, but it's not as funny as bang wang. With garlic? Is it fortified with garlic? All right, boy. Come on, let's bow wang this. Oh, that just smells like pure wow. garlic. I think these are little snacks made to look like cloves of garlic. It's corn, I think, and that is incredible. It feels like it should be quite antisocial to eat. It really stinks a lot. Yeah. I actually sat next to a lady on the bus the other day who was chewing on raw garlic. What? And I was like, are there like vampires around? <laughs> I sat down next to her and she said, I'm sorry, I'm just chewing on raw garlic. I like to do it. Do you mind? I said, doesn't matter if I mind, you're already doing it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was, I was 
going to get her to spit it <laughs> out. Classic Ollie line. <laughs> moving on. Moving on. Final bag of sweets. Oh my gosh, we've tried so many already. Ooh. Okay. Wait, whoa. What? What? It's purple yam candy. I didn't know you could make candy from purple yam. Okay, ready? It's kind of like fudge. Really? Like is. earthy fudge. <laughs> <laughs> like what compost flavored fudge. Texture is so weird. That to me tastes like food. You go to another planet and they're like, this is great. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I believe that you think it's great. Annie's Ube. Not a fan of the Ube. Final one, Oz. Choc nut. No. Oh wow, it's just, it, it's broken up in my hands. We have a lot of candy that's this shape. What is it? What's it taste like? It doesn't look like chocolate at all. It's really crumbly. It's a lot of nut. It almost tastes more of nut than it does of chocolate. It's like a crumbly paste. That's really strange. I quite like it, but it's it's unlike like anything it I've ever wow. had. Peanut milk chocolate is what it says. Interesting. Oh, it does kind of taste like peanut butter does, with yeah, chocolate. a little bit, but there's not much chocolate in there. It's like peanut butter and cocoa powder. That's what it is. It's funny how when you know what it is, it yeah. tastes so much better. All right, well, that's been Filipino yeah. snacks. The Jollibee spirit lives on, I'd say. The yeah. only one that I really Jollibee. didn't like, the one that was offensively bad was <laughs> little Peewee. Pee little Peewee over there. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Why did you pour the worst one? Peewee's revenge. Lifting. <laughs> I'm now covered in that peewee <laughs> dust. Great. All right. Well, oh. I'm going to leave you with your peewee. And uh, I'm going to get out of here. See you guys jolly soon. <laughs> oh, I just smell like... Like pee? Yeah, like pee.